I'll have to look into that later. Yes, yes. I like this one, this little... Uh, the charts dropping. Yes, exactly. Exactly, dumb killer. You said it so succinctly. So perfectly. Okay, person. Let's recap what we did on today's stream. Today's stream, we created multiplayer chatting. So here we have two clients running. Wraithbinder. And we can now chat between the clients. Okay, I'm here on client number two. And I'm gonna tar start chatting. So I press the chat button and I, uh, my chatting is going. Uh, this is my chat message. I press the enter key and it sends that off. So both of these clients have my chat message. They're both coming from my username here on this other this right client. This, the bottom right of my screen is client two. Over here, we're gonna switch to the other client now. This is a different client with a different username. My username over here is Nathaniel. Um, I'm just gonna type some random characters. I'm gonna press the space bar a bunch. Uh, I'm gonna press uh, the shift key so I can... Oops, not, that's not the shift key. That's actually the, the function key. Uh, the shift key, there we go. It's bigger letters, look at that. All right, there we go. Sweet, so we have multiplayer chat implemented mostly. There's one little issue left here um, actually two issues um, one is actually an issue the other is a feature so the the one issue is that I can't seem to type any of my special keys like exclamation points number keys I'll figure that out that's probably has to do with the way I'm processing key codes and um, the other thing is that we need to be able to do alt keys right so if you're typing on an international keyboard you want to do one of those um, letter O's with a little grave accent on it or something like that or a C with a little squirrely underneath it <laughs> I don't know what the names of any of those characters are I've never really used them but I know that people are gonna to want to chat with that so so pressing the alt key right right you're pressing you're starting a chat message and you hold down the alt key then uh, um, then you can type in some special characters so that's another feature that needs to be implemented. But for the most part, chatting is working. You can also, let's say I've got this chat message I'm typing and I press the escape key. It just cancels that message. So we have um, we have the ability to cancel there. So yes, success, success. I can't believe multiplayer chatting got implemented all on one stream mostly. 90% is finished, ish. All right, hey, so. That's all for today's live stream. Thank you for watching, person. I appreciate you. Hey, if you haven't signed up for the, the beta to play Wraithbinder, go right ahead. There's a form on, on uh, it's the it's a pinned, pinned post on my Twitter, twitter.com slash wizard underscore foo. All right. Thanks, person. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next week. All right. Later.